position? Sam Cordero, St. Louis quarterback. And you can prove this because look, they spelled your name on here. Who made this poster? Oh, uh, my, my, my cousin, my cousin made this team. The respect, uh, the mutual respect, both teams, and then you got the homecoming, senior night crowd. Yeah. How does it make you feel? Well, to bring home the W senior night, homecoming, feels good, like, for the Crusader alum and for everybody supporting us, feels, feels great. Some people are starting to doubt you guys, right? Just because Kamehameha kept it close last week. I keep thinking to myself, do these people on the mainland who, like, do the national rankings, all that other stuff, right? Do they understand how tough the ILH is? You can't really blow people out by 40 every week. That's an impossibility. They don't. Like, Kamehameha, Punahou, they're all good. And if you play them twice, that's nuts. They get to, like, learn from their mistakes. And yeah. obviously, Kamehameha did. They, they learned from the first game. And it's hard. Punahou's defense, I thought, they, they did the right things. You had to adapt to what they were doing. I'm yeah. sure they did some different stuff. So what were some of the things you changed? Like, it was different from the first time. Well, they blitzed more. They brought, they brought more pressure. Last time, they only rushed like three, but they brought way more pressure this time. Your feet work, your footwork, your vision, moving with your eyes up, all that, all that stuff that sounds so easy when you're playing Madden. Um, <laughs> you're doing it over here. I was shocked that they gave you space to run. Were you shocked? Yeah, I was. I thought they was going to keep me contained and all that, but I found little holes and I was, I was shocked. Did Coach Ron or you, like, change anything just a, a wee bit to make their spies kind of lose track? No, not really. We was just, stick, just sticking to the game plan last, yeah. last game. Especially that empty backfield. They, I yeah. mean, that's an automatic, oh, he's, he might run, but yeah. they had some communication issues. They were worried about who was going to catch the ball. Yeah. I think you guys have proven more than ever that... It's not a, uh, there's not a superstar in the offense. Yeah, we have a lot of weapons. Our offensive line is, is getting better every day and they're doing good. They're working hard and we have choke weapons, slots, wide outs, we move the ball along. They, they stunt or whatever you call it a little bit with the linebackers, and, but they never really got a clean shot on you. Yeah. They, they kind of chased you around and got a, a couple sacks maybe, but who picks up those guys? I mean, how do you guys communicate that? The whole line, they communicate well. And, they just talk about amongst themselves and they communicate well. Thanks, man. Thank you.